Hi, uh, I'm Dr. Amber Jean Marie Pabone. Uh, I'm faculty at the University of Pittsburgh uh, in the School of Education, Language, Literacy, and Culture. And uh, I'm also uh, a faculty fellow at the Center for Urban Education at the University of Pittsburgh. Um, so I'll share uh, a little bit about uh, two uh, forthcoming articles um, that I've published my dissertation um, research um, on um, the life histories of black male teachers. So one of those papers um, I wrote alongside uh, along with uh, Ashley Woodson who's also at Pitt and in, in you know in both in all of the work that I've been engaging in um, disrupting monolithic uh, narratives about um, black male teachers has been sort of at the center of my work as well as um, you know centering the, the lives and voices of black men who teach um, you know in their in, in their own voices from their own perspectives um, to sort of talk back to um, uh, negative ontologies um, that exist in the discourse. A, a recent piece in which I examine the schooling experiences um, of black, a group of black male teachers and couple um, social suffering as with life history methodology um, to engage in an analysis of how these teachers experienced uh, frustration, uh, marginalization, and misery in their schooling lives, and then um, uh, argue or suggest how these participants, for these participants, academic tracking was a site of social suffering. So drawing from um, Dumas's work on schools as site of as social suffering. Um, I maintain that this suffering persisted into the participants' adult lives uh, as classroom teachers as they witnessed and attempted to mitigate the struggling of their own black male students. And, um, I'm arguing that these findings have implications for further research on black male teachers as well as their recruitment and retention in U.S. public schools.